what they do best Helping their family and friends, that's the start They make a great team as they each do their part Caught up in the fifth grade rat race. <laughs> Anyone want to play soccer? No. You know, we should get away more often. Absolutely. Not you, too. Okay, flip. Uncle, <laughs> you're blocking my son. I can't read. No, the pigeon is blocking my son. Blech. Pigeon. Shoo, shoo. Oh, pigeons. Get out of here. Oh, no, he didn't. Come back here. Oh, nice pigeon. Very nice pigeons. Adios. Hola, preciosa. Maya, do you hear that? Miguel, stop trying to bother us just because we don't want to play soccer. Maya, Abuela's talking to herself. No entiendo. Talking to herself? No, no, no. She must be talking to... Ay, corazón de mi vida. You look so beautiful today. <gasps> herself. Well, why would she be doing that? Mm. Now, who wants to hear a song? My beautiful roses, red as can be, you grow in bloom just for me. And that is why my special few, I will do anything for you. <laughs> hmm? Maya Miguel, what are you doing in the bushes? Oh, uh, uh... And who were you talking to? Oh, uh, hey. Who are you talking to? My roses. Your roses? Why are you singing to your roses? Flowers need lots of love and attention, just like children. I'm going to Florida for a wedding, so I'll be away for a few days. I wanted to give them a special song before I go. Do you think that they'll miss you? I don't know, but I'm going to miss them. And next week is the Rose Championships. I just hope they'll be ready. Didn't you win last year? And the year before? But I don't like leaving my roses alone right before the competition. I hope they'll be all right. I can take care of them. You? Huh. Mi chula. Oh, gardens take a lot of work. I know, but I'm sure... Oh! You know roses have thorns, don't you? Of course. I mean, who doesn't know that? It's a big responsibility. I can handle it. You? Well, they need four things. Fertilizer. It's plant food. You put it in the soil around the roses. They also need sun, water, and lots of love. Do you think you can do that? Don't worry. I got this under control. Do you have it under control the way you had feeding our baby cousin under control? under control even better than that. Good. And thank you. I was so worried about my roses, but now I know they'll be in good hands. Oh, and Maya, this rose... Wow! This rose is the one that will win me championship number three. So make sure it gets special attention. Oh, I will. Thank you for trusting me, Abuela. I won't let you down. I know you won't. I leave this afternoon, but I'll write out all the instructions for you before I go. Oh, yeah. Ah, my safe frog. Uh-oh. 
Jimmy Kill, he's the greatest wrestler ever to step foot in the You ring. got the moves, Miguel. Yeah. Bravo. <laughs> oh, I do? Yeah, you should take up wrestling. It's a good way to learn discipline and stay in shape. Really? Hmm. Yeah! I am the greatest! I am the greatest! Thank you! Thank you! Captain Miguel, wrestling champion! Oh, Paco, going back to the pigeon. She trusted me to take care of her prize rose garden. This is a very big responsibility. Well, you know we're always here to help you. I am not going to let anything happen to those roses. Abuela is counting on me. Uh-oh. <gasps> Harder than you thought. I have everything under control. Like Chrissy's birthday cake? Want help? Nope. Got it under control. <laughs> that kind of stuff almost never happens to me. <laughs> almost never. <gasps> they broke the rose. What can I do for you? Senor Lopez, I want to be a wrestler, just like you. Well, you're a strong boy and a smart one. I don't see why you couldn't be a great champion. So you'll train me? Me? <laughs> well, I guess I could show you a few moves. Gracias. When can I start? How about right now? <laughs> Excuse me, Senor Lopez, but what is this? That's a wrestling uniform. Uh, not any wrestler I know. Ah, uh, you were thinking about that kind of wrestling. Yeah. That's a different kind of wrestling than what I'm going to teach you. I'll teach you the basics. This is where it all comes from. Not the glamorous life you expected, huh? Not really. I had to learn the basics before I ever put on a mask. You did? You bet. If you come here every day after school and do everything I say, no questions asked, I'll help you become a great wrestler. But you have to start at the beginning. You still want to learn? Good. The Rose Championship is less than a week away, and I don't think these roses have grown at all since last night. What did Abuela say they needed? I have her instructions right here. They have sun. Sure. They have soil. Ah, tierra. And I gave them water. Agua. I also gave them lots of attention, and I fed them. I don't see any fertilizer. Why don't we give them some more? Good idea. Plant food could do it. There. These roses will be in championship shape in no time. Hey! Shoo, shoo, go away! Shoo! Scram, get out of here! Oh. That's plant food, not bird food. Leave it alone! That's why all the fertilizer is gone! Hmm. Ah. Ah. <gasps> so awesome. That's it! I have an idea! As if the flowers weren't in enough trouble already. Ah. Ah. 
Taco, you stand guard and protect Abuela's garden until we get back. Don't you let those pigeons push you around. <laughs> okay, no problem. Come on. Taco's in charge. Anyone got a problem with that? <laughs> Okay, we can work this out. Ah! Oh, what? Every garden needs a scarecrow to keep the bad birds away. Scarecrow? Uh-huh. You're gonna look great. Me? Show them away! Show? Uh-oh. Oh, no! Abuela's rose! It's dead! What about Paco? Oh, Abuela trusted me and I let her down. It's gonna be okay, Maya. Yeah, it's only one rose. You still have a whole garden to kill. Uh, I mean, to take care of. Yes. Uh, how are they? They don't look any bigger, but I'm not worried. I have a new plan to keep the pigeons away from the fertilizer. Uh-oh, I smell trouble. This fan should do the trick. Ready? Very ready. Now. Hey, left. It's working, it's working. The pigeons are flying away. I'm going to teach you the secret art of... The Half Nelson Triple Twist Hurricane? Even better! Throwing pizza! Oh. Watch and learn. Ha ha! What's that got to do with wrestling? No questions, remember? Trust me. Now you try. So when I finish this one, then can we wrestle? When you finish throwing all of them, then we can talk. It's your warm-up. Oh, no. Whoa! Are you sure this is how you got your start? Oh, be patient, Miguel. The only way to get somewhere is to put one foot in front of the other and to twist my cinnamon rolls, mop my floss, and move my pot. So come on, let's get started! <laughs> while you put that one foot in front of the other. Uh. Uh. Abuela's roses aren't growing. Senor Lopez isn't teaching me anything about wrestling. I've tried everything. They have soil, sun, fertilizer, and they just sit there, not growing. Uh. At this rate, I might be a baker, but I'll never be a wrestler. Why is it taking so long? <laughs> That's it. Tomorrow I'm going to tell Senor Lopez that I'm quitting. And tomorrow I'm going to make those roses grow.
right, roses. You are going to grow. You get lots of sun, lots of fertilizer, you have soil. Time for tough love. So this should do the trick. Water and lots of it. All right. My backstory, it's flooded. I <gasps> think it just got worse. <laughs> agua, agua. Que lío. Tell me again what happened. The hose, it was crazy. It had a mind of its own. It was alive. Uh -huh. Now we have to clean it up. Agua, agua. There's so much water. You know, sometimes a job like this seems too big. But if you break it down and just put one foot in front of the other, you'd be surprised by how many pizza, I mean, how many buckets of water you can throw. Miguel, I haven't seen my feet since we walked in here. Just be patient. One bucket at a time. Hmm. Let's do it. One bucket at a time. <sighs> Here, Maya. Here. Thanks. Here you go, Maya. Hi. Oh. Sorry, Paco. Miguel, you were right. We just have to be patient and take it one bucket at a time. Yeah. One bucket at a time. Miguel, where are you going? Uh, Gus? Miguel, I thought you didn't want to learn wrestling anymore. That it was taking too long. Yeah, uh, about that, I, I changed my mind. What happened? Let's just say I put one foot in front of the other and was surprised at how much I could do. Glad to hear it. Now take out the trash. But, all right, I'm in. <laughs> at least the worst part is over. Hola! Oh, my beautiful roses, I'm home. I think you spoke too soon. Mm -hmm. Let's see what good care you're taking of my rojo. My tita, why didn't you follow the instructions I gave you? I wanted them to grow bigger and faster, but instead I just messed everything up. I gave them soil and water and sun and fertilizer, but I guess I gave them too much. Mm -hmm. Abuela, I'm so sorry. I didn't mean it. Can you ever forgive me? <laughs> Mi preciosa, I'm sad about my roses, but of course I forgive you. And you want to know something about flowers, Maya? They require patience. That's very important. Oh, patience. <laughs> Hola, mis amigos. Did you feed my dear pigeon friends while I was gone? Friends? Yes, of course. Yeah, right. Oh, they were just hungry. Delicioso. Here, Alberto, some crumbs for you today. Oh, my God, 
look, it's beautiful. I can't believe it survived me. You know, it only takes one perfect rose to win the championship. I can't believe you won the championship! Smile! This picture's for the school paper. What's the name of the winning rose? Maya's perfect rose. Oh, one more. Paco, get in there. Uh-oh. We've got company. Pigeons aren't so bad after all. Got it, thanks. No! <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Fish. Maya, I have to go out of town again next month. I was wondering if uh, you would take care of my roses again. Really? Oh, no. Really? You would trust me with them? Of course, Maya. I would trust you with anything. When you come back, your flowers will be bigger and stronger. No, when you come back, Abuela, your flowers will be loved and cared for. And alive. Perfecto. Ah! 